Hello everyone, my name is Peter and today I am with Misha as always for some Happy Home Designer Verses. Hi everyone, today we are designing Deirdre's house and I've heard people say it's pronounced Deirdre but I've always pronounced it Deirdre so that's how I'm saying it. Uh, but anyways, Deirdre requests an autumnal atmosphere for her house and so that's what we're going to stick to for this video. I had Misha say her name because I didn't know how to pronounce it. Um, <laughs> but uh, yeah, so uh, and today's common question of the day is, what is your favorite season? So we'll get into that in a yeah. bit, but let me start the timer so me and Misha can get designing. And uh, it's going to start in three, two, one, yeah. go. All right, Misha, you have, uh, you have the first take of uh, favorite season to distract you a little okay. bit. Okay. Yay, perfect. Well, mine is actually autumn. Deirdre and I are, are kindred spirits. I love autumn. I love the falling falling leaves, the different color leaves all over the ground. It just has such a... I don't know. There's just a feeling in the air, you know, that like starting to get, get colder and cool off, summer ending. Um, just makes me want to wrap up in sweaters and drink coffee and walk around outside, go through parks. I love it. Um, cause summer normally gets, I live in East Tennessee and it's really humid here. So summer gets really, really hot. I mean, you live in Florida, so it's also very, very hot down there too. Um, but yeah, summer's just like a little too, too much for me. Autumn has the perfect, perfect balance. And I love the color scheme and I love like the, <laughs> I love the fall fashion. Um, like my, my autumn outfits are some of my favorite outfits, which I think is a valid reason to like a season because it's how I'm going to be dressing the entire time. So might as well like it. I gotcha. Okay. For me, I think that's all I have to say about autumn for now. Yeah, you go ahead. <laughs> for me, uh, I'm a, I'm a January baby. So of course I love winter being from New York. Uh, having all the I'm snow. I'm a January baby too, but oh. I don't like winter. Mm -mm. See, but see, but see, but see, it, it's okay because you know, I'm the real January baby. Yeah, sure, okay. Um, <laughs> and uh, yeah, I just, I mean, I can't wait to like what December. I'm done. I finally, they finally gave me my diploma. I'm that street bowling it back to New York. It'll be Christmas time. You have yeah. Times Square. You have, you know, you have Rockefeller Center with the tree. You know, you got the snow. It's just it, you got the cold. I love I love the cold. Uh, being in Florida for all this time, I've I've learned to despise the heat. I really yeah. I really do love the fall though. That is a very very nice season, but um, it's like I don't know in, in New York the the humidity in in August is is miserable. I mean that's still summer. But oh like, yeah, definitely. But like it it gets oh it. I'm not, I don't know, I'm not a, I'm not a heat guy. Yeah, like you said, I've been in Florida, so it's an, <laughs> I've learned to just be like, oh, God, no. No more heat, please. Yeah, I can't do just, like, either extreme season. I like spring and autumn more than I like winter and, and summer. And I don't I think I... I don't know. I feel like any time I'm in a season, I like the other seasons better. I'm like, oh, I'm tired of the cold. I'm ready for it to be hot. And then by the time it's hot, I'm like, oh, I'm ready for it to be cold. I just always go back and forth. But I wish seasons changed like every month. I wish I could experience a season for a month and then go go back to another one. Isn't, and that, isn't that like in like other, Harvest Moon? Isn't like Harvest Moon have like Yeah, yeah, in uh, Stardew Valley. Yeah, it's one month per... <laughs> Per season, it's like 28 days for each season. That's be, that'd be perfect. I'd love it. Okay, I'm getting Deirdre. Some I, I, nice, I, don't, uh, I if I can skip summer, trees. then I'd be happy. That's my least my least favorite season. I I don't like I don't like the heat. I like yeah, I like I like the events that go on in summer because we have a lot of like music festivals and and food festivals, the farmers market and that stuff during during summer, which is really fun. Uh, but yeah, it's just so hot and humid that you almost don't enjoy going out to those events because of how stupid sticky you get. Yeah, no, I feel you. I don't know. I'm I'm just like if if people like my subscribers who like went on way back. I used to wear a wool hat like 24/7 until my <laughs> I, my hair grew long and then I couldn't wear it. I couldn't fit it on my head. 
and uh, I used to die in the heat. Now I don't wear it anymore, but um, yeah, it was it, it was. Hot. Why would you wear a wool hat in the heat? That sounds like a <laughs> terrible idea. Because I'm a schmuck, a great a schmuck. <laughs> I, uh, I, it was, oh, it was the Were worst Were you one of those ever. kids that was wearing, like, long sleeves and sweaters and wool hats all through the summer and just clearly being miserable but toughing it out anyways? Yeah, it was, one it was, of those then, guys. like, <laughs> when, when I used to, when I was flying, right, the cockpit would get in Florida around, like, 100 degrees, so I would, like, melt inside. <laughs> like, it was, it was, it was bad, man. I, I... I don't. I would just wear. I just wear like a baseball cap now. So, but I do miss my wool hat. People. People want me to bring it back. They want me to bring back the old. You should old just for part. maybe like a throwback video. <laughs> yeah. Wear, for, wear the hat the next, again. The next cuckoo's kitchen. I'll. Uh, I'll wear a hat. Yeah. All right. All right I'm, you still I outside? Searched, or like, you inside yet? I just got inside. I just searched like wood. In the, wood. <laughs> I just searched wood in the search bar, so it's bringing up, uh, like, basically mostly the Modern Wood series, but a couple other items I think I'm going to use. Oh, definitely a fireplace that will add to the Gosh. autumnal atmosphere that Deirdre, Deirdre I think I'm done with outside. Requires. I'm going to go inside now. She wanted an autumn theme. I'm going to make it spooky autumn. No, okay. Spooky autumn. <laughs> you always make it spooky. <laughs> All right, let's see. That's that's not. Why does she want a pile of leaves inside our house? Okay. Oh yeah, I'm redesigning Deirdre so she doesn't have like a. You're lucky. Mandatory can, item. I'll, I'll, but the pile of leaves the is. I'll take is the hand. I'll take the handicap. I'll take the handicap because you know we're, <laughs> hey, we all know I can use, this episode. I can use the pile of leaves too to make it fair. Actually, might use it anyways, because the floor I'm using is the autumn leaves, so it would kind of, it would blend in with it, it would work. It's a lot of leaves. I just looked at that, that's like too leafy. Yeah, it, it is a lot of leaves. I mean, it just, I feel like wallpapers and floors look really weird until you fill the room with, you know, with yeah. the furniture. So sometimes you have to just design it and then come back to the wallpaper and floor and see what actually, what actually works. Okay, it's time for plants. It's always time for plants in here. I gotta gotta put them beside the bed, put them in the corners. Um, some of these, some of these in, mush, the mushroom series is so cool. I have uh, one of the yes, houses. Yes, I love it. One of the houses in my town I based off like a uh, like the Kokiri from Zelda. So I wore like the mm -hmm. mushroom stuff. It's uh, it's pretty cool looking. It's awesome, yeah. I love love the Mush series. Um, it's so cute the way the that you more, find like, it fantasy. in New Leaf too. Yeah, the more fantasy the themes are, I think the the better they are. Yeah, it feels so magical. It feels like you're bringing nature inside. It's very magical. Let's I'm gonna see. steal your idea and type in wood and see what comes up. <laughs> yeah, I just brought up the Mush series, so I stole your idea too. Um, I love the mush coat hanger. Oh, it looks so this. cute everywhere. Always. We gotta get firewood. Yeah, that was one thing I got from searching, uh, searching wood. Oh, I wonder if I have the... Hmm, so many things, I don't know. Don't forget music don't, this time. I don't know if I have. Oh god, I probably will. Hold on, I'm gonna add that now. <laughs> Always forget. Uh, so you don't forget. Let's see, I'm in the wrong category. Okay, there we go. Um, jukebox seems good. I feel like I used a jukebox last time too. For whoever's house we were doing. Oh, um, with the bakery, I believe you did. Oh yeah, yeah. Blue bear. Coming up on our 10 minute mark soon, or an 8 minutes and 40 okay. seconds. Okay, so. I feel like I'm kinda halfway, halfway through oh, here. Boy, I'm not even, I'm not even there yet. <laughs> See, maybe, f yeah, that's a good song. I need a different bed though. I, do, I ended up not liking the modern wood bed. Maybe, maybe the cabin bed. I'm trying to figure out more. what's a good theme. There we go. A good, like, song. 
Rock okay, maybe I'm not halfway done. Maybe I got a little bit more room than I thought I did. Let's see. I'm gonna throw out my piles of leaves now. Maybe that'll fill in oh, some yeah. room. <laughs> now I'm doomed. You got the leaves on the floor? Um. I got the leaves. Yep. Yep. Let's see. That should go on that side. The leaves right there. Let us see what we can do. Yeah, I'm trying to think of another area to put in here. Uh, she needs a kitchen. Oh, okay, I've got... kind of have an idea in my head now of what I wanted to. We'll see. Um, the chair can be moved. You are, uh, I'm just gonna let you know that you're doomed. Because, uh, <laughs> oh, am I? Because right now, I'm, I'm, I'm putting down something I think looks real sweet. Uh-huh. So, uh, wonder, wonder what it is. I don't know. Co cozy homes are kind of my forte. I'll be I, know, I, know, yeah, so. I know, I know, I <laughs> know. You, you outbeat me in there. <laughs> so I've been, I've been recently, I've been looking at the comments. I've been recently kicking your butt in, uh, outdoors, so... But. Yeah, yeah, you have been. A lot of people will will like your outdoors more and my indoor more, and sometimes vice versa. So, so yeah, I think I, I love think I'm the doing pretty good. Love the different cabin so series well. customizations, all the different colors. Just the colors don't really matter. All the... mm. I need it. I, you know, I never got a stylist, so you know my big fingers are just like misclicking everything. <laughs> I, have to, I have to get one soon. Okay, I've got most of my areas like kind of laid out. I just need to add details, but now I need. I'm gonna give her a kitchen area. Oh, well, maybe with the sloppy sink that could look cute. But it's cozy. You think she's really gonna have a sloppy sink? I don't you, know. You look down upon whatever you pronounce her name with. <laughs> uh, let's see, there's a campfire. So that's all outdoor stuff. Why would I want to put a cornucopia in here? That would look autumnal. We want to give her a cute like dress that. that we can hang on the wall. Um, yeah, the sloppy seek doesn't look right with the stove. I wish there was more sloppy kitchen stuff. It just doesn't match. I just wish there was more kitchen gels. stuff in general. Yeah, true. I wish there was, like, good-looking wooden kitchen stuff. It's all, like, white or steel, which doesn't really fit with a lot of, uh... A lot of themes. Yeah. Hopefully in Happy Home Designer uh, 2 for the Nintendo Switch. <laughs> Happy Home Designer Deluxe. Yeah, Amiibo Festival. <laughs> Let's see. I saw you did a video on it. I never talked about it with my fans. Um, oh, what about E3? Yeah, I mean... Yeah. More or less, I'm, I'm, I'm kind of a, a mixed feelings that they didn't renounce Animal Crossing right now because I'd rather them have a bigger, more people own a Switch, so it's better of a game. Yeah, that would definitely open them up to to a wider audience if they did Animal Crossing. And Monster Hunter, they didn't announce Monster Hunter for the Switch, which is great. Well, they said they're not, they haven't ruled out porting it or like localizing it. For, I don't want double. For the Switch. I don't want double cross. I want them to yeah. put the one from the PlayStation and the Xbox on there. I don't care if it has lower graphics. That's the one that we deserve, not <laughs> a 3DS port. Right, the... right. I don't know. It's it's like it, this E3 was a mixed bag for me. I, I enjoyed it, but I didn't. But I did. Like yeah, I, I mean there were some fun announcements, but overall I was I was disappointed that we didn't hear about. <clears throat> there are several things like Smash Bros. We didn't hear about Smash Bros., which is yes. also uh, a really big bummer. But I don't know. I feel like I could see them doing saving Animal Crossing for like holiday next year. Yeah, um, that would be a really 
probably a good move for them, uh, even though I want it earlier, but from, from a business standpoint, <laughs> uh, that could be good for Nintendo. I just want it now. So impatient. Yeah, no, I got you. Yeah, if you're, I don't know. I like, I like. I'm, I'm then, I, I always set my bar low with Nintendo when it comes to like E3 or, or directs, so I can be surprised. Like, yeah, I'm super excited that you know Samus is back. That's the thing, something that people wanted more oh, than yeah. anything. They've been bugging Nintendo about that for a long time. So, so it was a good, it was a good day for uh, for Metroid fans. But yes. I've never really played a Metroid. I'm. I'll probably try it out. I'm I'm excited for for it to happen, but at the same time, I wanted an announcement for my my big passion, my big favorite game. I don't know. I, I just think I think it was I think it was alright. I had I think I had more fun making fun of Xbox than anything like I do every year. <laughs> like I yeah, Xbox One X S whatever yeah. whatever that long name is. People gave people gave a lot of crap with Nintendo for the uh, Wii U. The Xbox One Deluxe yeah. X is a dumb name. Yeah, and it sounds like like you can't tell what. You're saying because there's the Xbox One S, then there's the Xbox One X, which they sound so similar when you say them. It's just, it's so silly. So silly. Oh, there's some autumnal stuff I could have put outside. I might have to go back outside in a minute. Had a couple things. I need to step up my, my exterior game, apparently. Yeah, apparently. <laughs> That's apparently where I got you beat. Yep. Okay, where'd my kitchen stuff go? Is it here? There we oh, go. Man. I don't think I'm gonna win interior because I don't. It's not. It's not cozy enough. It's not. It's not doing <laughs> it's it. It's not me. cozy enough. <laughs> it's only four minutes left. I think I spent too much time outside. <sighs> I think I can do this. Picking some food for Deirdre right now. She definitely needs a coffee oh, maker, Lord. and she needs one other thing. Maybe... Oh, some fruit. Yes. Hmm. What else? What else can I add for her? Yeah, I've got to get some things on the walls. i got to get some things on a couple, uh... Couple tables here. Time's running out. What, what you know. doing? You gotta... I'm working on it. <laughs> uh, I just got a couple details really to do, and then if I have time, I'll hop back outside. What else? What else? Three minutes left. Sure. Oh, a bookcase would have looked nice in here. Should have added a bookcase. Oh, well. enough room. You need to have a cup of coffee that she made from her coffee machine in the kitchen and then hmm. Well, you, have a little, you have a little kitchen area. Yeah I made her Jeez. made her a small kitchen. Um, I'm trying to decide what I want to put on the fireplace. Whenever they can you have you always been able to set stuff on the fireplace? I can't remember if that. Yes yeah you can. Okay. You always could. Because there were a couple things that they added in the Welcome Amiibo update to be able to like set items on. Um, now which you're was always awesome. allowed to uh, put things in the fireplace, which is which is sweet. Okay, now I need something. I should have just put a, a uh, windmill in her house and call it a day. A windmill. <laughs> Actually, it might not be a bad idea to put outside. With two minutes left, I can sacrifice the inside vote for the outside vote. For the outside vote, yeah. Yeah, I think I'm done inside, maybe. Uh, less than two minutes. Oh, no. Let me head outside real okay. quick. Let me see what we can do here. Oh, where's her shirt in here? I need an autumnal-looking shirt to put on the wall by her bed. There we go, there's her shirt. Cute. Cute enough. Alright, got a minute left. 
See if I can do one more thing outside. I'm adding this window. Maybe. You're heading the window. You're going for it. Uh... Oh no. I can't move it in that one area that I want it. Let's see. Oh no. Okay. How much time we got left? Oh, I don't even know, but Deirdre's getting a camping cut. That's all I can say. There we go. Alright, I'm calling it. I'm done. We got 13 seconds left, <laughs> according to my timer. Oh no, we got 10 seconds left. I, I gotta call it too, because of inside. <laughs> so we'll just let the timer run down. Yep. Oh, Deirdre, I hope you like this. And that is it. Alright. Time, yep. Alrighty. Let's talk to Deirdre and see what she decides. I like how she says, you're done, yo. She, she, she <laughs> yeah, you done, like yo? Talk. <laughs> yeah, she said, yo. Yep, all too. done, yo. <laughs> Sweet, right. dude. So oh. let's, let's, I, I, I think you beat me inside, but I think my outside game is pretty strong, so. I don't know, I kind of try, I try to come back with my, with my outside game, we'll see. I yeah, be like, sure to vote in the poll that we've got in the video. Let us know who won. This time I won't forget. I, got no <laughs> I have to do it like right when I'm uploading the video, otherwise I, I forget. Yeah. Or like right after it's uploaded. You can't add them until after it's uploaded, which I don't think is fair. Because you can forget about it by then. Yeah, so I ended up using the, the forest wall, which is like the mushroom, it matches the forest Well, Is it called the mush wall? I feel like it's called the forest wall. Which one? The, the one with the mushrooms in it? Yeah, it has like autumnal like trees and mushrooms at the bottom. Yeah, that's the mush wall. Yeah, okay. Uh, and then I've got the autumn leaf, leaf floor. Uh, the the trees with the maple leaves, that has to be one of my favorite like wallpapers in Animal Crossing, though. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's so pretty. Oh, I think outside. you might do the town address. Next, next stream. Next stream you do. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Yeah, one of my mods is like almost done with her dream town, so I'm gonna finish or visit her soon. I'm a visiting friend's dream town. So. Yeah, I gotta... Hopefully they didn't ban my 3DS. With the, with the online stuff. Yeah, yeah, my 3DS that I record with, I haven't, haven't been banned, and I just don't have my Wi-Fi turned on on my old 3DS, so gotcha, I just gotcha. don't know if I have been on there. Dude has not moved, she's just like hopped around, I've got a few stumps around a campfire, and she's just She fell asleep, she fell asleep on one of my stumps. Nice. Yeah, I've got the camping cot for her if she needs a nap, but she's just sitting by the fire. And I just used her whole, like, the mush-themed exterior. It looks so perfect. I couldn't change it any. She says, it's like you took my old house and replaced it with a new one. Wow, she said the same <laughs> thing to me. She said the <laughs> same oh thing to me. Dear Dre, so sketchy, telling all the same things to all the same people. But I then, where's the old one? <laughs> That's crazy. Girl what is a, gone. You got a, a new liar. crib. Uh. Again, guys, thank you so much for watching our Happy Home Designer Versus. Don't forget to comment below who do you think won and also vote in the poll. And let us know who you want to see next for Happy Home Designer Versus. And be sure to check out my channel. We do the Happy Home Designer Versus videos on mine every Thursday on Peter's every Tuesday. So be sure to look out for both of them. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.